the measures that we would expect. Any the system here apparently helps people to trouser more cash. Well, the rules, are, the rules are so lax in some areas that you can find yourself putting money in your pocket before you know what you're doing. Right. OK, so you're saying really that it is a gravy train? Oh, it can be. Yes, yeah. it can be. And the rules w that we have in place in the Parliament are not those that we would expect of any other public institution in Europe spending public money. I've heard that you can earn a million pounds, make yourself a millionaire in, in one or two terms here. Is that real? Is that true? It has been true. If you simply say that um, my staff budget, I'm going to pay it all to my spouse. My, the entire lot. I, I employ four or five people. But if, you, if I wanted to simply pay my wife for that money, instead of a, you know, doing her job as a teacher, I could have done so. Yeah. And if over a five-year period, that would have given me half a million, and there's other ways, too, of putting money into a pot. After these elections, an MEP's salary is going up. They're going to earn £81,427 a year. Oh, and on top of that, there's the staff cost allowance. Now, this is changing, but at the moment, you can give £180,000 to members of your own family if you want to, if you say that they work for you. Oh, and I've forgotten the £40,000 a year for office cost allowance. Now, if you want to, that £40,000 can provide a room in your own home. £40,000. Ah, and there's the daily living allowance. That's to provide accommodation for meals and other things in Strasbourg. That's a flat rate. £263 a day. And I always forget the travel cost allowance. No matter how much your ticket costs to Strasbourg or Brussels, you get reimbursed at a flat rate, often hundreds of pounds more than the ticket actually costs. That money can go straight in your pocket. I can't think of anything else at the moment. I get money for a ridiculous amount of money for my travel expenses. I make a surplus on that. I, I, I feel it's dirty money, so I don't put it into my own pocket. Right. But some of it goes to charity and some of it goes to my political party. It's my, in, in law, it's my money. Other people buy houses in Spain with it. Yeah, yeah, but shouldn't, if you really want to be squeaky, shouldn't you be giving it back to the uh, European Union? I, I think we should have the rules which make sure it's given back. But, you know, I'm not, I'm not, I don't try and be a, a huge moralist. If, I, if other people are putting it into their pocket, well, you know, and in law, it's my money. What do you want me to do with it? As I say, I give some of it to charity, I give some of it to my party. Well, you could I just write don't like a, it. You could write out a cheque and give it back to them. Well, I could. I could do that. Will you, will you consider doing that, then? No. <laughs>